All right. Hey, guys. The long-anticipated season two is finally here. Your boy, Anker. Your man, Riz. I don't know why I say my name in such an American accent. Should you do an Indian accent? Hey, your boy, Riz. Is it a house? It was. Riz one. Riz one, right? Whoa, whoa. whoa. Why did you add the Latin role? Riz one. Riz one. I mean... Should I be like the young generation, the TikToker? Should I be Mad Riz? Is that how it should be right now? I think, I think you already are Mad Riz. W Riz. It's not like a choice. It's a <laughs> lifestyle. So it's been a whole year. We recorded a whole season, which was kind of dope. I think it was a great experience as friends, as entrepreneurs, as content creators. And my life's definitely changed. I feel like... I come hang out with you at random dinners, and you introduce me to people, and they'll be like, oh my God, it's Ankur, the guy that you do the podcast with. Yeah. What kind of stuff have you run into in the past I actually year? had a recent experience where I um, was at your high school reunion. Oh, man. FOMO. <laughs> your 20-year high school reunion, and you couldn't make it, and I knew everybody. Everyone's like, they looked at me. They were looking at me funny, like, did you go to Lawrenceville High School with me? I was like, no, but I am best friends with Uncle Gar. They're like, oh, yeah, we saw you on the podcast. I was like, yeah, that's me. So that was cool that everyone kind of knew of me already um, by just the I, podcast. I don't know. LHS 2003 isn't commenting on these episodes. So well, I don't know that they're even watching. They told me because you didn't show up to the uh, oh, reunion. Okay. That's why I see, you've I been see. banned. You've been shadowed. I'll be at the 25 year for sure. Joe, I promise you I will be at the 25 year, even though you didn't shout me out in the sponsorship packet, <laughs> but we'll, we'll figure this out. Good stuff. So what about you? What else has been new? So I was living in Jersey city when we were recording season one and I now have moved to the suburbs because I got engaged. Woo, woo. Congratulations, or I'm sorry, however you look at it. It's and definitely congratulations, for sure. I got a winner. It's congratulations for you, but it's I'm sorry for me, right? Because I'm, you know, as they say in all marriages, you know, we gained a sister, but you lost a brother. <laughs> That's just what it it's is. Is this like a rough draft of your speech for the wedding? Is that what I should do? I should plan. I should just launch episode four, maybe, for the wedding. Oh, yeah. I'm like, hey, guys, for you to check out the best man speech, please log on to Rockstar <laughs> Podcast. <laughs> that's called a shameless plug, right? <laughs> you know, that's not that's not a bad idea. <laughs> I just got my own speech pre-recorded. For your vows. Right, scan this QR code. <laughs> Is your fiance even watching this? Right now, for sure. Okay, cool. Blown up on her 72 inch TV, and she's judging us very, very hard. Okay, okay, just making sure. I gotta see what I can say and not say. <laughs> also, in the past year, I've left corporate America. That was kind of a big deal for me. Yeah, what's what's that like? How many years have you been in corporate America? Who do we count Pittsburgh as corporate? It is corporate because there's nothing else unless bridges and work. There's nothing else in Pittsburgh. Do we count shreds as corporate? No, that was your own business. That was my own business. Yeah. So then, six years back to back, I was doing corporate America work, but uh, you know, all things, all good things come to an end. So what are you doing now? I jump-started the agency back up. Okay. Built a studio out in Springfield, which right. we happen to be in right now. Right here, Flex Studio. Check it out. Flexworkstudios.com. Oh, yeah, yeah. Tribe Studios and Flex Work Studio. It's very confusing. It gets confusing, but we'll explain it throughout the season. We're going to have to unpack this multi-studio. Uh, we got to clarify, right? What is that called? Partnership? It's not a partnership. It's more like it's a, a... support network? Support network? Wait, is that for alcoholics? Like 911 DJ? <laughs> is that what it is? We built our own support network. I mean, you never know, right? Sometimes you have to have overflow. Hotels have this type of thing in their system all the time, right? But we can dive in at a different episode. We'll dive episode. in on a different episode. But yes, I think we both have been very busy. Uh, we both have evolved and matured as people. I have gotten taller and stronger and faster. Right? I'm like Thor. Pretty much right now. Thor gets taller, stronger, and faster? I, and listen, in my mind, he went from dad bod to god bod, and that's what's going to happen The god me. bod was real. Yeah. So that's that's what's going to happen to me. But yes, I guess the best way to describe what you and I are, we're like the multiverse of businesses, right? The multiverse of businesses? <laughs> so there's like a multiverse somewhere where you and I are sitting here. I, I own the podcast, and you have your own photography studio. You know? I was going to say that you and I are like chai wallas, pouring chai for someone. Right here. I mean, these ideas has gone through our mind. So there's infinite number of possibilities and infinite things that could have came. So I think season two is going to be super dope. 
There mm -hmm. are tons of new content, tons of stories that have happened in the past year that we get to talk about. But what I'm most excited about is that your audience, and my audience, has grown in the past year. Yeah, and also merge. I mean, we've always had common friends, but uh, I think our network for business and work always was different. You know, our our philosophy, our style is so unique. Even though we're so close, um, the podcast has brought th that together. I meet people that you work with; they already know me. Um, and you meet my people, you don't have to reintroduce yourself, even though your name is Encore, right? All right, listen, man, we gotta break some tea. Oh, no, shoot. that's not the right thing. Spill, Spill the, the tea. tea. Spill the tea. It's me. All right, I'm, so. I'm the problem, it's me, go ahead. It's not that we're sharing audiences, it's that I'm stealing your audience. What the? Okay? I know you think I have you on mute on Instagram, but the truth is, I don't need the notifications because I watch that thing like a hawk. So every time you get a new follower or you follow someone new, I'm right behind you following them, mm. commenting on whatever's going on. I'm just not paying attention every time you're in the car. Well, I mean, you did the analytics for our season one, right? I did. Right. So what was it like? Like How many views? How many comments? What was the engagement? How many likes? So the engagement's a little disappointing. We'll okay. get to that in a second. Okay. But 10,405 subscribers. Wow across all the different platforms that we posted on. Wow, that's huge. That's amazing. Yeah. Right? I I didn't even hit those kinds of numbers with Youngry when we first launched or mm, any other podcast. I remember Youngry, yeah. But the, the really exciting email came from Spotify a couple months after we launched mm -hmm. where they syndicated us and they made us one of the featured video-only podcasts on their platform. Wow. Which was amazing. So we're a syndicate. We're part of a syndicate? We're I syndicated. Feel, okay, I feel like, like a... Like James Bond. This like is a evil. mission impossible. Okay, all right, all right. Just double checking. I don't want to be evil. I'm trying to be a better person. I mean, we could call Tom Cruise, but if, if we were spies, yeah, would would I be Dwayne Johnson? And would I be um, Kevin Little? No, Kevin Hart. Kevin Hart. Yeah, yeah, for sure, right? <laughs> I was. I'm the guy from the 10 year anniversary for the, the <laughs> right. <laughs> the guy who used to be really fat in high school. <laughs> Oh, Actually, I, I'm pretty sure I was skinny and I got fat now. It was the opposite for me. <laughs> Something like that. Something like that. Can we put a visual up? <laughs> 309 engagements. Mm. Unique. So my father's only one of them. He's not like <laughs> 200 of them or anything like that. I love you, Dad. Thanks for being involved and commenting all the time. But 309. Hmm. I was how hoping. Do you, yeah, how do you higher. feel about that? I was hoping it'd be a lot higher. I feel like not enough of our friends are supporting by explaining how much they cried or laughed mm. or enjoyed any of the episodes or right. clips. And that's exactly how I feel about you on our social media and our posts, right? When I post something, that's because I know I you're call watching. You and text you. I know you're watching, but you're not engaging. That's all I'm saying. It's all good. <laughs> Listen, like. <laughs> you're Set up. To, you're starting to sound like an angry ex girlfriend. <laughs> I mean, listen, man, I'm a single man. I lost my uh, long-term relationship that I had of 23 years. Are we going back to the speech? Okay. Right? So, uh, you know, I just got to lay some things out since we're spilling the tea. Well, I'm telling you, man, I'm watching everything. And I'm trying to steal that entire audience as quick as I can. Hey, it's all good. Nothing that I give you can be stolen. <sighs> Nothing that you give me can be stolen. But some stuff that you give me has a cure. Has a what? Has a cure. As a cure? Yeah, you're just going to take a pill for it. <laughs> no more pills. No more nothing. You know, I have actually took that vow, and I have not drank anything all this year. Wow. Yeah. Um, have you become an imam? No, 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 I have not. I have not, you know, followed that holy path. But um, Have I'm you done hajj? Like, what's going on? No, 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 no. I don't even know if I'm going to be allowed in Mecca. I might burn at the gates. <laughs> but no, man, I'm just really busy. And uh, honestly... It's just that time. I'm turning 40 this year and um, just trying to make some serious positive changes to my life. And um, I just don't want any toxins in my system. I want to be totally clean. I want to be cleansed. You know, I just want to, the only thing I want to drink is coffee and carrot juice. That's about it. Carrot juice. Carrot juice, man. I just love carrot juice. It's do something. They, do they even have carrots in Bangladesh? Uh, who cares? I'm in America, bro. I go to Bangladesh and like, they don't talk to me. They don't want to hang out with me. They call me a gringo out there. No way. Yeah. I go to India, and they only want to talk to me. Nobody wants to talk to me. <laughs> All right, well, season two is going to be rock solid. And the one thing that everyone can hope for and know is going to happen is that we're going to go deep. We're going to get into our feelings. Emotions? Listen, man, you know I don't do feelings. My own therapist you know, can vouch for me. I don't do feelings. 
lies. Okay, well, whatever you want. I'm an open book, um, but I can't wait to catch everyone up with all the things that you and I have both been doing. Because um, this is it, guys. This is the last season because Anker Garg is getting married. So stay tuned. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, Spotify, he's lying. Uh, there's going to be more seasons. <laughs> all <I> our promise. <laughs> sponsors. <laughs> uh, but I think we should start off by doing an episode about how our friendship has changed. Yes, because coming on to season three will be his fiance. Season four will be his child. You know, season five. You know, you guys are getting the drift. What's happening right now, right? Yeah, I'm building my own football team. Okay, that's cool. All right, guys. Well, tune in to season two. Every yes. single episode is going to be dropping on Wednesdays. Final season. I can't season. wait to see your comments. Final season, guys.